cool. Um, wow, this is crazy. So, I, I am supposed to read something about this one. So, um, one second. This ship is called the uh, Voids Edith, and it's from... This one is from some guy. Now, real quickly, I want to I want to read you the description because he sent me a read me to read along with it. So, uh, Voids Edith. Uh, let me find it. I think it's in my downloads here. Uh, damn it! Where did I put it? It was a read me with the Voids Edith. Uh, other games. Because it's a pretty, pretty cool description. I might need to pull it from the, uh, the thing you sent me, Voids Edith. Read me. Oh, where did I put it? Too many mods. Is there read me, read first? Uh, yes, okay, here we go. So this is from some guy. The ship has 45 health. And as an optional challenge, complete the game with a starting loadout. Bonus points if a hull repair drone and a drone recovery arm are acquired. Some trivia about the ship. It uses 17 gibs, or the parts you see when the ship breaks apart for the hull. It took over four hours just to make the hull. So this is a, an original hull build from some guy. Edith is a woman's name, English in origin, and means prosperous in war. The ship's name can read as, The Void is Prosperous in War. The original idea from the ship came from the question, what happens to all the ships that get destroyed? So this is what happens to all the ships that get destroyed, apparently. So this is uh, this is some guy's junkyard ship, basically. The description says, Ship made from the scraps of battle by a lone human with a few friends he found along the way. Armed with a few scavenged weapons, some homemade ones, and a hodgepodge of systems, they decide to go on an adventure. All right, so uh, that apparently, I mean, getting this all together, <laughs> this is crazy. Double scrap recovery arm, slug repair gel. What a, what a, what a ship, I gotta say. What a ship. It's got four crew. Let's let's check this out. Lots of power. Uh, it has an artillery that says it's an artillery beam. Okay. Fire beam, breach bomb, advanced flak, flak. Um, two system repair drones. There's something green here. There's an ion something. What is this? A drone laser. I don't know if this is bro. Okay, I think this is, uh, this is either broken or, wow, this is such a, this is really is a hodgepodge. Or it's, um, the, um, whatchamacallit. The beam drone's weapon. Okay. Actually, moving weapons around is going to be kind of a pain with this many weapons and drones. Can I do this? Yeah, there we go. So, breach. Dual lasers. Oh, God. Okay. Uh, what is this, TF Richards? This is a, an amalgamation of ships. Yeah, I can't use auto fire. Yeah, I know. Um... So I can use my breach bomb here. There's weapons behind this. There's a fire, a fire beam, and okay, so it's just the fire beam that's off the screen. So I have to move that around. I don't know how I'm gonna get access to that if I want to actually use the thing. Um, can I power system repair drone? If I hit five, oh, I have teleporter too. Okay, so I have a crystal dude. Oh man. Um, I don't know if I'll do teleporting on this ship. When I start off with six weapons or whatever this has, I usually want to use weapons. Okay, so the three is this kind of thing. Yeah, okay, all right. Uh, maybe I shouldn't use that. That is always super OP. <laughs> yeah. uh, that is super OP. Oh, I have cloaking too. Wow, I have like all the systems. I have all the things. Can you take the drones out of the bay and see what the numbers are for your other weapons? Um, there, you can't, you can't use numbers for weapons past four. The UI does not allow it. I guess we do that to keep missiles, or yeah, missiles offline. 
It's one, two, three, four, and then drones is five and six. And that's just how uh, how that works. Um, so drones are five and six is what it is. Okay. Um, all right, so you have a missile. Now, you know what? <laughs> this all right, we're gonna we're gonna just do that for ships with the missiles. Let's get an eye on you a bunch of times. I do have cloaking. This ship is so OP. <laughs> okay, uh, missing something there. Something missing there. I'm not sure what it is. What's this a pun? Ryan has his eye on you. What's the pun? The pun is that I have an ion weapon. This this ship starts with two shields. I was going to say, it doesn't have defense drone, but it does have cloaking, so this ship is... Oh my god, this ship is OP. Is that the missing cloak image? Is that what it is? Okay. We do need to, because this is a 17 Gibbs or whatever, we need to let this ship die once. I don't think there's any way we actually lose this run. Please help me remember, I need to do a secondary run where we let the ship die. So I just I have to see what it looks like flying apart in 17 pieces if if he set that up, which I assume he did if he put all these gibs together. So you guys help me remember if you can. Just lose. <laughs> I don't want to do it now. I don't want to do it now. Um, what do we want to get on this ship? I guess we want to get rid of slugger repair gel, get like a pre igniter and something. Hey, T.F. Richards, thank you for the follow. Appreciate it. Welcome to the stream, my friend. Appreciate that. Just lose. Is that a Kenny? Just die. Just get a house. Just get a car. Man, click to fire weapon. So OP. That's probably, that's probably what that was meant to be, actually. Imagine the flackening that could happen on this ship. Um, it wouldn't be any better than a normal one. Well, than a, a max one because four flak, four flak ones would still be eight weapon power. And there's no way to go above eight weapon power on this. Even though we start with an advanced flak. I actually usually don't like advanced flaks in my flakening because unless you can get two of them, which is impossible, uh, I'd rather have just flak ones because they would time out better. Kenny has come to your streams a few times. Glad you got Nightbot now. <laughs> uh, what does that mean? Is, you need the anti-trolliness for Kenny. One, two, three, four, five, six. I think we do that. It's over 35, Josh. You still get five more power. I'm talking about this ship. Yeah, I mean, this is one of those ships where we just have all the things. Okay, well, if you're going to give me the flackening, I'll take the flackening. Sorry, Breach Bomb. Sorry, slug repair gel. I would love another flak. I would just, just love it. All right, there we go. Um, so there's three out of four already. <laughs> Not the fire beam. Yes, this this amalgamation is is gonna be a flackening. You ended up with three flak ones on your Gila monster run yesterday. Went swimmingly nice. But fire beam is amazing. You know what's amazing? Flax. You you always expect Kenny to troll? Yeah. Uh, okay, they're in my hacking over here. I'm also going to my sensors over here, it looks like. Oh, crap. I'm not going to get there in time, am I? Well, that's some BS. There we go. Do, 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 do. do we have Heal Bay or Clone Bay? We have Clone Bay. All right. And it is online. Good. Uh, this fight's not going super well. Crystal Dude is somehow losing to a human. Are you really going to lose to a human, Pippa Luck? Oh, my God. You should be embarrassed for yourself. How did that crystal lose to a human? I actually don't know how that happened. 
I guess he was 1v2-ing for a couple shots too long or something. Fly trash, shoot trash. <laughs> the ship is not trash. It is a well-constructed amalgamation of various components. That looks a little trash-like. But, you know, it's not trash. She may not look like much kid, but she's got it where it counts. In the immortal words of whatever his name is. Han Solo. One, two, three, four. Okay. AKA a Frankenstein. There you go. Not trash, it's a Frankenstein. Uh, shut down my engines, that's fine. Do -do 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 -do. You know what I don't have is level two sensors using my mind control, actually. Oh man, I'm tired, man. I had a, a good but long weekend of lots of singing. Which is good, but tiring. Nice. Get that weapon training in. Just man sensors. But I, I want to man the other systems. Besides, I have... Wow, I have more systems than I'm supposed to have, too. Okay. <laughs> I was wondering, why do I have so many systems? Because I have all of the systems. Yeah, we literally have all the systems, don't we? Okay. Well, some guy went all out for this build. Just... A Frankenstein in systems and ship pieces. Come join my crew, Charlie. Oh. NG train. All right, now I will man doors since I just bought sensors. All things considered, though, it's well polished besides the missing cloak image. Floor image interior not opening door, overlapping with doors. Men and glows are good. I have a feeling some guy may have used your guide. <laughs> may have taken note. I mean, heavy laser would be amazing, but using it would be a pain. Unless I got rid of the click to click to use ion. This click to use ion thing just seems too cheesy to me. So I'm gonna get rid of it and get out. I'm gonna get the heavy laser. It just feels too feels too op. Can't do it. All right, we're ready for the boss now. <laughs> And you start with battery? Yes, you start with basically every system you can get. So it's uh, the Frankenstein that has all the things. It is Void's War Edith. Eads Void's War something. It means something like something about war. It's like a war machine. And it's freaking OP as hell. Okay. Pirate or Uncharted Nebula? We don't have long-range scanners. Let's go pirate. If you actually want the link for um, where these ships are, TF Richards, type exclamation point FTL ship. I believe is the link. The Void's Edith. There we go. The Void's Fortune in Battle. Okay. Do I want to buy a Mantis? I kind of do. Do I try to see if I can get a free one? Yeah, let's not be greedy. We have... We have... Plenty of stuff. We can afford to spend a spend some scrap on crew. I will say it's hard to get around this ship. There's like a connector over here we could get around faster, but what's the venting like? Most of the vents are actually in rooms I want to be in. That's kind of weird. Engines, weapons, and shields all have vents. Like manning rooms is manned rooms is often a strange place to have a vent. Vent placement, I feel. There's manning and artillery? Is there? Oh, there is. There's a little room. Wait. Oh, I... Oh, that's why. There's no door here. That's gotta be a mistake. Okay, yeah. He's not acting like you can man it. Okay. That is weird, though. He did put a computer like there. You could, like, you could man it. That's pretty funny. See, did I save his position? I did. All right. Doodle -doo 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 -doo. All right, you got my control, which I can counter. It looks better with the manning in there. I feel like any room looks better with that. So, yeah, I would agree. Uh, he shouldn't be able to do damage to us. So let's try to take out his piloting. Beautiful. 
Even on the flagship, it's purely cosmetic. Oh, yeah, oh yeah, like the um, all the dudes who are manning the art, the weapon systems that are actually artillery systems. It's interesting that I didn't know. I didn't realize that their manning was just cosmetic. That's pretty funny. The more you know. All right, what are you gonna offer me? Two fuel fixing scrap, not good enough. You do have a missile though. Um, I do have cloaking though. Okay, so we can vent you. I'm going to greed this. Well, I was going to... Okay. No cloaking for me. I was going to try to cloak both of them, but apparently this was a one damage missile. That fired faster than I was prepared to deal with. I wanted to cloak the entire volley, so that was greedy. Uh, is there a teleporter? Maybe that's how you were supposed to get there. A teleporter. There is a teleporter on the ship. Oh, how are you supposed to get from here to here? I'm not exactly sure what you're saying, Tyler said. Did a test by hacking it. Cooldown was the same. Powered hacking versus unpowered. Ah, interesting. Cool. This looks like a nice balanced ship. <laughs> balanced. I feel like this ship is not balanced in any sense of the word. Not weight-wise, not... Strength-wise, not color-wise. There is no balance. <laughs> this is the Void's Edith. The amalgamation of a Frankenstein battle monster. Battle monster. What's up, Zach, Zach Dog? How are you doing? Investigate. Come join my crew, Charlie. All right, we're going to have NG's manning everything. Kind of cool with that. Let's go have you man the artillery that doesn't work. Chain burst laser. Oh my god, I watched a stream where the streamer had four chain burst lasers. And they were all charged fully. It was constant pew, 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 repeat. Yeah. I feel like that's worse than other setups. But as far as a pew, pew setup, it's a pretty good one. Can't remember if I've ever gotten full four chain burst lasers. I feel like maybe I have once. Okay, see here. Let's do this. We will cloak the missile this time. Not be greedy. You weren't actually looking at the screen, but heard there was a missing door. Okay, yes. This door is missing. T Sadly, you can't teleport from your own ship. If you could, though, it'd be faster to teleport. It'd fa be faster to run to here and then teleport to here <laughs> than trying to run there since there's no door. Yeah. If you time them right, it might be constant fire. Oh, I'm sure if you stagger them. Yeah, I bet it would be. That would be pretty interesting. I wonder, because the fastest charge time on chain laser is what? Seven seconds? So seven divided by four would be two shots every under two seconds. So that would be about constant fire. I'm curious if that would be faster than double Vulcan spun. I would guess probably not. One, two, three, four. Four, five, six, one, one, two, three, four, five. Okay, so I can't get all five here. Nice. What is this monstrosity? It is the Void's Edith. This is a ship created by some guy. And that is th that is their name. Everything at the weapons. Um, fully trained weapons. Yeah, if you have fully trained weapons, well, and, 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 uh, automated reloader is what you'd want. Three automated reloaders. SE server still angry? I fix, I don't know. I haven't been on since the stream. Somebody said it was still up on, that it came back up on Friday. Do I need to check it? Hold on a second. Real quick. Let me check it. I never, I didn't check the response from the guy after the stream, and I was so busy this weekend, I just didn't have a chance. Let me see if it's saying if the, if it, if the server is up. Stream stuff. It's down again. No, no, 
you don't have to apologize. I'm kind of I'm kind of getting frustrated with this thing. What happened on Friday? The, sh the server went down. Uh, I talked to the people and they said they were working on it. And now the server tab is not opening. It looks back now. We'll try to join. Okay. Well, it's not loading on my end. Like the uh, page that I have access to, the page that I have that's supposed to allow me to do stuff with the server is not loading. I feel like I feel like GTX Gaming is having an issue. It's a .co.uk. Pie boy, get your get your UK servers to work. Get them on the ball. But it's I can't even load the server page right now. I'm getting kind of frustrated with it. It didn't work all day Friday, the day when I stream with it and. Now it won't load when I try to load it. You able to get in? Okay. All right. Well, that's good. I'll have to... I'm going to have to... One thing I really hate about being the admin of a server is I have to do more crap off stream. I just... Time is... Time is precious to me, I will tell you. I spend so much time on the stream, off the stream, that when... If there's any extra stuff I have to do off stream, it's, it's so... So tiring, man. It's like old times, Pie Boy being blamed for things. That's right. So, X Winner provide you fa provider fails you like that. Well, yeah, it's better than my internet provider failing, but yeah, it does suck. Okay, I don't need double system repair drones. Time is money. Time is money. Four chain losers with full weapon training and three auto loaders. They fire three every. They fire 3.5 seconds. So staggered, you can fire one every 0.8 seconds or something. Okay. Um, that's slightly slower than double, that is, that is slower than double Vulcan though, right? Because what do we figure out double Vulcan is? Like one every 0.6 seconds, and if you have two, that's one every 0.3. I forget what the fully upgraded Vulcan is. This shit my eyes, what's that PhD? Uh, <laughs> that's a worthless deal, sure. Here, I'll trade you three missiles for three drone parts, okay. Vulcan is better, but that would be funny. SE is Space Engineers, by the way, TF Richards. It's a game we play on Fridays with viewers, and I have a server for it, but the server's been having issues. It's far better than Double Vulcan because it burst because it's burst shots. Really? You think it'd be better than Double Vulcan because of the burst shots? That's if you have them all together. We're talking about spacing them out so it's constant fire. So, I don't know that would be better. It died again. The server died again. I don't... Uh, God damn it. I can't I can't mess with it right now. With X... It's, it's just not loading for me. Maybe between runs I can try to do something with it. I don't know. I don't want to keep uh, interrupting my run for that right now. If you want to word a, send a strongly worded letter to the GTX servers... Because I'm definitely not getting my money's worth if their servers aren't going to work. First Vulcan, same as second Vulcan. You both wait the same time to deal damage. Four chain lasers deals damage first volley. If Again, if you time them at the same time. We're talking about staggering them. We're talking about staggering them and then being fully charged. So yeah, I mean, technically four chain burst lasers probably are better, but meme wise, fully charged, all that kind of stuff. Um, I'm trying to see which one would would be more, have more shots basically, and I think double Vulcan would have more shots, but I'm not 100% on that. Do listen to their problem. Wow, so many choices. All right, so human crew gets me another mantis. Mantis gives me scrap. All right, sure. All right, Agent Smith. Four chain lasers is not a meme, though. It actually works. Well, I don't think double Vulcan. I mean, 
They're both memes. When do you ever get those? Sure, that actually works. So does Double Vulcan. They're both, they both work. Um, let's see, how many jumps do I have? Six. One, two, three, four, five, six. But it's very rare you get either of those. Just because of RNG. I've had good hosting experiences with the GameServers.com and Ping Perfect. Well, the one that I'm using is the official one. The one I'm using is the official servers uh, by, um, used by uh, space engineers. The ones they probably are paid money to endorse or whatever. But I haven't had issues until this past week. Okay, I don't want to, I don't want that. I would like a defense drone not available. Look, a boarding crew. It's true, I could board. This ship, it's two-man boarding. Why would I ever board when I have all these weapons, though? I don't, I don't feel a need to board. I feel a need to blow stuff up. Get the half laser one, heavy laser one, because I don't need it. I was thinking of doing it, but just the difficulty of actually firing the thing because of this overlap means I don't want to. <laughs> I just don't even want to mess with it. Don't even want to mess with it. Even fighting, firing the dual laser is going to be a pain. Ha! <laughs> we uh, knocked his missile down with our flax. This is how it goes. It might be a DDoS on the host themselves. Think so? Yeah, I don't know. But last Friday they said it was a data server issue or something, and it never came back up. Or at least it didn't come back up in the hour or two that I checked it. Okay, that is a pulsar. But I'm not afraid of anything with our current build. This ship is so stinking OP. Look at that. And I just assumed my cloaking would be up. Thankfully it was. They like to give vague reasons. Well, I don't even know if it was a vague reason. I, I mean, I was talking to a customer support person who actually responded pretty darn quickly. But, uh, you know, still a customer support person who probably doesn't know the exact issue. I'm sure the tech people are like, we're working on it. It's a tech support issue. Um, so if I go to the store, I would be diving. Diving's not that scary, but, well. Yeah, let's actually... This would actually be a very good dive. And I have cloaking, so... Again, I am so OP, I can I can dive. Wow, this just this thing this thing is a hoss. This is literally a frickin' tank ship right here. Ship is crazy, man. Uh, give them nothing. NGs can't feel fear. I go one, two, three, four, and then dive, okay? Uh, attack the ship. So this would be a ship I would say balance is not really online perfect or anything. <laughs> but it is a fun OP ship, and I do like my fun OP ships. I got some doges there. Doodly -doo, 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 doo Usually go something like this, tech guy to customer service guy. I can't figure out what's wrong. No idea when it'll be fixed. Customer service. It's a minor problem. It'll be fixed tomorrow. <laughs> sounds, sounds, sounds right. And I was asking the guy, will it be done soon? Because I'm actually streaming right now and he never responded. So, uh, okay. So heavy laser two. Would be good because that would be an eight power weapon system and I don't have to worry about weapons going off the screen here. 
So, we're going to go ahead and do that. All right. We have our boss weapon system. We are fully online. Goliath online. I feel a little bad because those who are big Space Engineers fans, I wasn't able to play much on Friday, but... You know, it's 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 rough when you have no control over stuff like that. I should get level two clone by just to just to uh, have a value point. All right, we get third shield next. So your Charlie artillery is just the normal artillery beam, yeah. Morning, Rand. I've been catching up on Colony Three. How am I? I'm doing great, Nordic Bear. I was just we we're actually just talking about. Uh, option not included how there's at least two of us who are who are addicted to the game right now. Another streamer that I know, her name is uh, Verosa, is also kind of addicted to it right now as well. Damn it. The absolute best thing he could have freaking bombed, you piece of crap game. Yeah, I was going to cloak that. So unlucky and unfair. Couldn't dodge with my 39% dodge. I haven't started on the artillery power. True, but artillery is, in my opinion, one of the most useless systems in the game. So I am not... It is not a high priority for me to upgrade it. You notice I have eight weapon power. We're going to, like, Sector 4, right? I don't need artillery. Artillery is a luxury that I don't care about because it's it's weak. Fully, fully upgraded. Fires every 20 seconds. Um, most enemies I'm going to fight are going to be dead far before we hit 20 seconds. Maybe not. It might take me two volleys, so they might get off one shot. Cough system repair, drone cough. Uh, that's true. Yeah. Right, I'll turn it on. Turn it on just in time to do nothing. Vindicator artillery got to detect some modding points for that. Oh, because he didn't didn't put a special artillery. It's very obvious what we get now. Swag sensors. <laughs> I am not Farb. You will not. You will not seduce me to your Farb ways. Chase them. Nice. Or maybe it's the pie boy way, not the far boy. I don't know. It's the pie boy and the far boy. Nice. Because I don't like the Vindicator. Seems like you're not alone in that opinion. Oh, I think Vindicator artillery is worthless. There's never... I can't think of a run. There might have been one maybe where I thought, wow, sure is a good thing I have artillery on this ship. <laughs> That wasn't a modded run, I'll say. Farb is the one who ran the quad chain laser. Oh, well, Farb's a Farb is a fellow streamer friend of mine, so that's awesome. Uh, didn't I sell one of you? Sure, I sold one of you already. Did he? Did he just randomly get that, or did he try to get that? Because he usually does um, like hard mode no paw streaks, right? So sounds like he just randomed into that. Okay. All right. Well, this heavy laser was fun, but time for us to flackening. Double scrap recovery arm. Yeah, this ship started with that and a slug repair gel. And right, so now I need a one power weapon for that final slot. Uh, oh, that's a pre igniter. All right. Bye bye. One scrap recovery arm for the pre igniter. Okay. We got a pre ignited flackening. GG. He started with one, then first store found another. It was crazy. Nice. That sounded like uh, one of my runs the other day I had where I got... Where I actually did get a full flackening on a ship that started with no no flack. Alrighty. Auto fire. 
All right, well, there's my RNG for the day. We got three, no, two flax. Because I started with an advanced flak and a regular flak already. This artillery is never going to be used. Oh, crap, I am boarded. Um... Ooh, nice. We saved the repair drone. Beautiful. All right, follow this guy around. Where are you going? I'm going to the O2. There it is. Do 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 do. So if you started with chain burst laser, that means you probably had what? Was that on the slug C? I think Slug C starts with Chain Burst Laser. Maybe the Lanius A, possibly. And if I don't get that store, I'm not hugely upset. Although I can't afford an automated reloader and a long-range scanners right now. So let's check it. Let's check it out. Well, there's a Heavy Laser 1. Defense Drone would also be useful. So do I sell the System Repair Drone to get either of those? Let's do that. We'll get the defense drone. This ship is just so beyond powerful. It's insane. Uh, one, two, three. Yeah, I guess we probably have to do that. Pretty crappy sector layout here. Get closer. See what's wrong. Demand the ships pay the agreed upon price. Free hull damage? Free hull damage. Great. Free hull damage. Uh, no, f no fires. Though. I don't hear any fires. God, this ship is so huge. I have never seen a, sh a ship as Frankenstein as this one. I don't think. I think it literally has a piece of every, every vanilla ship. Oh wait, this black isn't even a um, is a auto scout even that's crazy man it's even got an auto scout at the front of this thing does it have a lanius piece maybe the silver piece right here is a lanius uh do i see any crystal so maybe it's missing crystal and lanius actually i'm not sure if i'm seeing any crystal or lanius parts to this those are kind of angular and well one is angular and one is round so it might have been hard to fit them in Hard to Frankenstein those in. God, that almost looks like it doesn't connect to me. It'd be crazy. I wonder if they would ever randomly spawn a, a sector layout where you actually could couldn't get to the exit. I don't think that can happen. But that would be kind of funny if that actually happened at some point. Uh, you can't board me, so we do this. Okay. Wow, we are just one-shotting everybody. No, one-shotting your weapons and stuff. Alright, well, one day we'll get third shield. One day. Stop mind controlling my dudes. Is this a... This is a regular nebula, not a slug nebula. Why, right? Why are we? Uh... Why are we getting so many slug ships in this nebula? Oh, this is slug controlled. Okay. Apparently, I forgot what sector I was in. <laughs> this is one of those runs where we're so OP that I'm not like really even paying attention. <laughs> All right, I haven't got the Rock Homeworlds quest yet. Hey, achievement on a wing and a prayer. Use only the artillery beam to destroy an enemy ship while taking no hull damage. Or using the Federation Cruiser, use a crew and four special blue event choices by Sector 5. Get to Sector 5 in the Federation Cruiser without upgrading. Okay. Um, all right. Well, we already missed one of them. I could probably do... I forgot that I have these achievements. I could probably do the artillery one with this ship. So I'll probably upgrade artillery just to get that, um, just to get that achievement. So we need to upgrade our, our shields and artillery and then find a ship that's going to do like no damage to us. 
with cloaking and hacking. I don't know. Do y'all think it's cheaty to get these achievements on modded ships to like go for these achievements? I feel like it's a little cheaty to do that. Maybe I won't do that. I feel like getting ship unlock progress on OP modded ships is not in the spirit of <laughs> unlocking ships. Feels too cheaty. One, two, three. Do, do. Is chat broken? It, I haven't seen chat move in like oh, a couple of minutes. Maybe, maybe chat's just quiet. Okay, it's working. It's working. It's just a quiet chat right now. Ow! I took damage. Hey! You're engrossed in Oni. No worries. I, I wasn't trying to pull people out of lurking, but I'm like, occasionally I'll ask questions to chat and then nothing happens. I'm like, is Twitch broken? And usually the answer is no. All right, so I'm gonna not. I'm gonna not do the artillery achievement. Search for the ship. Free stuff. Uh, looking for long-range scanners or automated reloaders. Oh my god. Um. Well, I could replace the advanced flak with the regular flak just so they time out perfectly. <laughs> Do I do that? Uh, Because I can't get this other flak online. <laughs> oh, man. All right. Four of eight flax. We did it. We got four of eight. Just have five flax. Don't use it. Just have them. That sounds like the correct play. That's the correct play. All right. Let's get shields. <laughs> That's so ridiculous. Just have five flax. How do you win FTL? Just have five flax. Swag flax, that's right. By the way, thanks for the stealth B tips. Literally won my next run. Nice, Ren. Grats on that. Stealth B is a difficult ship. So, getting the win is definitely an achievement there. It's a great ship sometimes. And it's a horrible ship a lot of the other times. That just dies sector one from uh, from uh, offensive drones. You're now working on the stealth Z stealth C grind. Stealth C I think is stronger than stealth B because its weapons are actually really good. Stealth B is your favorite, but you're bad at FTL. I used to like it more than I do. I've been convinced of its badness because of all the people who do the hard mode, no pause streaking, and that's what it's really bad at. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, we'll do that. Hey there, speaking of Kenny, what's up, Kenny? A wild Kenny, Kenny boy appears. Stealthy weapons value point is worth not even real Kenny. Not even real Kenny, Pog. All right, here we go. Strong enough to destroy you. All right, quest marker next sector. So this will finally be the Rock Homeworld's quest. Ah, uh, this won't unlock anything, so that's why I'm not. Why I feel like it's fine that I on what I do this quest. I've had like two or three chances to do it on not unmodded and failed every time. What is this ship? This is the Void's Edith. It is like an amalgamation of all the broken, lost, messed up ships that have ever happened kind of thing. All put together with duct tape, I guess. <laughs> now, this is from some guy who created this one. Who likes to put piloting in the back, I think. Was it some guy that said they like to do that? Somebody said, maybe it was Zach Dog. Forget. Okay. 
I'm a little worried because I haven't unlocked the sea ships that I might not have access to some of the ships that I want to, uh, uh, that I have ready to play. I always forget the artillery actually does count as a blue option for beam weapon. Beam weapon blue option. All right. This is crazy. Pre-ignited flackening. Pre-ignited flackening. All right, hopefully some of the other ships will be more of a challenge. And by more of a challenge, I don't mean completely underpowered. But this ship is so OP. So stinking OP. NG. NG means I won't have an option to skip a Zoltan if that's what that is. But let's do it. Alrighty, we are looking for the rock quest. Thank goodness it's not a random sector where I can't get to it. No running away, Mantids. Oh man, we one shot that one guy. Poor Mantid. Poor, poor Mantid. Hey! Okay, so this is a different NG quest. This is the one that... What is that one, dude? Does that unlock Stealth A? No, I thought it was the the actual NG Homeworlds quest that unlocks Stealth A. I forget what this one unlocks. Does it unlock anything? I can't remember. It's kind of crazy since they changed the way the... Um, how you can unlock ships just by getting wins in. I forget the specific unlocks for things. For a lot of the things. Do, 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 do. Hey, Rock Guy, why aren't you fighting in there? Hey, Rock Guy, fight him. Thank you. Go shield. Uh, we'll go cloaking twice here. There we go. No more cloaking. Do, do, do. Do, 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 do. No. <laughs> oh, don't set my O2 on fire. That's not good. That's going to burn down, isn't it? It's just too far away. Well, NG got there in time, I think. No. Oh, the fire freaking spread. Damn you, FTL. Damn you. Do, 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 do. I feel like an old fart when I say, well, back in my day, you you had to unlock the ships the old way. You had to get to find the quest. You couldn't just win a run and unlock ship back in my day. Uh, do I want to get... Do I want to get virus? Sure. Let's get virus. So Charlie was our engines guy. Morning, Darth Flacus. What's up, Cole Cancerian Warrior? Have I ever told you the story of Darth Flaccus the Wise? No, Master. Tell me about Darth Flaccus the Wise. Well, it was his opinion that Flax were the most overpowered weapons in the galaxy. He thought he could take over the entire galaxy if all he could do was collect, collect all the Flax in the galaxy. Um, do I have anybody else with piloting training? This guy's got a little bit, so I'm never going to get shield training. So I'm going to put you there and you there. Now I'm going to put the human here and you over here. Just unlock ships on easy and pause. Yeah, well, that's true. That's, that's, that's true. I have 415 scrap. You do it on lower difficulties when you first start. This is an odd ship. It is. Is this ship overpowered? Yes. It starts with all the systems. Two shields. It's really overpowered at the beginning. Starts with six weapon slots. With all of them filled. One of them a point and click ion weapon. So. I might have nerfed it slightly by going to full flackening. Honestly. 
Ship nerfed because full flackening. To do, to do, to do. All right, what do we got? Okay. Hence why you called me Darth Flaccus. Because of the flackening. I am Darth Flaccus. I am not the Senate. I am the Flack. The Force is one with me. I am one with the Force. The, whatever that guy says. Uh, the Flack is one with me. I am one with the Flaccus. The flackening. I'm just, I'm not even spending my scrap. <laughs> Who needs to spend scrap to win? Not me. Oh my god. Scrap recovery arm even gives us a blue option. All right, we're going to break a thousand scrap, I think, this run. I mean, in my hold. In my cargo hold, we will have more than a thousand scrap. That is our new, that is our new goal. Although the uh, sub-quest for this, sub-quest, the bonus quest was... Getting hull repair plus drone recovery arm. I don't. I guess that's kind of supposed to go with the theme of recovering scrap and stuff. Hey, okay. Uh, and we get rid of our human. Beautiful. Get out of your human. So now I can put you on shields. And you back on engines and you on doors. Max Artillery, why not swag sensors? <laughs> Any plans on playing RimWorld again? Um, not not currently, Kenny. Was there... I feel like I've seen people play it. Was there like a patch or something for it? Or a DLC or something? I'm enjoying Oxygen Not Included. That's giving me my... Um, whatchamacallit fix. My RimWorld fix. There was a large patch, new updates, added to more mechanics. Okay. What does it take to make max artillery? Um, well, way less scrap than I have. Uh, it's probably a couple hundred. Uh, 130, 160, 160 plus power. But I want to break 1K scrap because reasons. Oh, is there another scrap recovery arm there? Whoops. Damn. I get repair arm for the memes. Grabbing pieces of stuff and putting it on my ship. I'll do that. Physics fun was always my favorite part of Dwarf Fortress. You love all the dealing with fluids, gases, and stuff on Oni. Yeah, it gets pretty overwhelming, but it's 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 fun. Yeah, it's just the normal flak. I mean it's just the normal <laughs> flak. It's the normal artillery. Nothing, nothing super special about the artillery on this ship. We have basically all the vanilla of ship parts. Vanilla ship parts, all the vanilla systems. Vanilla weapons, vanilla systems. Ship is so vanilla. All right, do we get out before the artillery, uh, before the thing? Yep, yeah, nice. Ooh, double NG. I might not break the 1k scrap now. Because I... Um, bought the... Something. Bought the... Repair thing. Oh, okay. I'm gonna get a second virus. <laughs> For a second there, I was like, what happened? This is virus quest again. I don't think I've ever had gotten virus twice. Which one's the real virus? Not even the real virus. <laughs> Why I have two viruses? Uh, this is in honor of the coronavirus. I don't know. Too soon? This is weird. Um, I, I've never had double viruses. Can you be the new virus? But then I won't have two viruses. <laughs> Corona confirmed. That's right. Although it's called something different now, right? All right. All right. Fine. You can be the new one. So I can tell the difference between my two viruses. You know, when you have a bunch of viruses, 
inside. You want to be able to tell the difference. Do, 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 do. COVID-19, that's what it is. Uh, secure the cash. All right, we should be able to break 1K scrap. Once called Corona, the other clearly has to be called Lime. Oh, yes, I've seen that meme on Facebook. I'm not sure I like that one. It's just... Why was it originally called Corona? Do we know what the reasoning was behind the original name of it? That's a great deal. All right. See where you're going, human. Choose your death room. Oh, he left. Okay. It is Corona, not Corona. Corona is a strain of viruses. Oh, okay. And it must be part of that sh one of one of the that strains or something. I don't know how viruses work. Viruses, how do they work? Nobody knows. They've been about for a long time. Heard the reason was it was shaped like a crown. Ah, okay. Like the actual physical shape of the virus. Interesting. Okay, anything useful here? No, but I can sell this and this. All right, we almost hit that 1K mark. Kind of like how the cold is rhinovirus. Oh, okay. I didn't know that. Wow, that was some good dodges. All right, kill each other. Do, 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 do. All right, there we go. Over 1K scrap. Two hits with Flack with all those misses. Yeah, that guy had some insane dodges, but I don't care. <laughs> we are so stinking overpowered. Measles is caused by rubella. Uh, rubella virus, I guess. Eight power weapon system, not even scary. Not even scary. I see your eight power weapons, and I raise you eight power weapons of my own. Cold sores are a form of herpes. I think I have heard that. Um, okay, one, two. Th I think I only got two gems here. All right. There's an automated reloader. Okay. So I will sell... Um, which do I sell? Repair or scrap recovery arm? Probably scrap recovery arm. I have over 1,000 scrap. I think I can lose that. Oh, there's my long-range scanners, too. Right at the end. All right. We won't get the long-range scanners just because it's a bit of a... Bit of a waste. So we can do another dive here get one extra jump. Excuse me. Oh, gosh. Actually, I could do like a triple dive and get multiple extra jumps if I wanted to. And I might want to. When you're this OP, you can dive like crazy. Yeah, that was, I think, the third pre-igniter we've seen this run, actually. It's kind of ridiculous. There are runs when all I want is a pre-igniter. Never see one, and I'm pretty sure we've seen three of this run on this super OP ship. I stop reward. Okay, so we go here. So we go here, then here, then we would double dive. Yeah, we can do that. We can definitely afford a double dive. Hey, I'll rescue the store. Oh, wait, by the way, there's no more jumps. Watch this be two empty, two things I can't do. You had a pre-igniter and you got a free one from phase one. <laughs> tra la lol, says FTL. Tra la 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 la. No, I forgot that I even have defense drone. Let's use it. In a failing kind of way. How about we fail in our usage of that? 
Like, how would you like the best thing in the game when you already have one? <laughs> so it becomes... Well, I guess it became, what? 60 free scrap, though, right? Give them nothing. Only 25, so it doesn't give you the full value of it, huh? Let's see if I can go... <laughs> Let's see if I can go everything, actually. Let's just go all the things. Um... <laughs> I'm just like, like mix and matching my, my stuff here. All right. There's swag sensors for you, Kenny. Not, not Kenny. Kenny doesn't care about swag sensors for you, pie boy. Okay. Man, can't even fully upgrade my ship. Not even super OP. Not even the most OP ever. Hey, welcome back, real sim. Not even Sector 6 swag sensors. That's right. Not even Sector 6. Why am I so underpowered? Time for trash flinging. Thrash fling. <laughs> <You> yeah. <laughs> Is that autocorrect that you did thrash twice? Feel the wrath of Doc Flaccus. He likes to fart a lot as he throws trash at you. Kind of like Darth Flatus, but, you know. Right. I guess that was my pun. Oh. There we go. No med bay, weak ship. That's right. We're so weak right now. He was dodging like a mofo, though. mofo do. Okay, waiting for stuff to come back up. We dodged that, so let's wait for our backup battery. Which, wow, that lasted a really long time. What the flack is this? <laughs> this is what you call an OP ship. We have all the things. What I will say is none of the shields go off the screen, so... At least it's got that going for it, that it doesn't have a giant hole in its shield, so that's nice. Maybe we'll actually use artillery here. Uh, didn't even one-shot the shields, man. Bet I did not shoot the deputy. Wow. You must have value point shield or something. Go level three cloaking here. Should last long enough, I believe. Oh yeah, plenty of time. Plenty of time. There it is. No more weapons for you. Imagine having to take care of your crew. This post was made by the Clone Bay Gang. <laughs> Imagine having to actually heal your crew in 2020. This ship looks OP? Yes. Yeah. Yeah, we've, we've almost completely upgraded everything. And we have every system in the game. So that's how OP we are. Maybe should have even capped kept scrap recovery arm in hopes I could get fully upgraded on every single thing, but I don't know if that'll happen. Battery always comes back. Not if you jump, Pie Boy, while it's still being used. Oh, alright. Um, do you have any more training? Okay, you're slightly better than Nellis here. Actually, you're a lot better than Nellis. Nice. Get out of here, Nellis. Get eaten, cannibalized by your own crew. Fully trained uh, Mantis Vider is pretty awesome. Looks a bit messy. No, this is uh, the uh, the idea behind the ship is that this is the collection of all the other ships that have runs have failed, and somebody pieced them all together to create the Voids Edith is the name of it. So it's supposed to be messy. Yeah. <laughs> It's held together by super glue and 
wishes, okay? Wow, zero hits. Um, okay, let's hack your piloting then. <laughs> All right, with no with no piloting, we got one shield down. Amazing. Oh well, I actually can see his. Um, since I have the max sensors, I can actually see all the system power. I'm not used to being able to do that because swag sensors are low on my list of things to purchase. Did you miss the Death Star? No, I haven't played the Death Star. This is the Trash Star. <laughs> uh, I took over that as a repair station. Do I have anything to sell? I guess I could sell Repair Arm and Advanced Flak to try to get Everything fully upgraded, or I guess we had an automated reloader if they've got one. <laughs> Is that the fourth pre-igniter if I've seen this run? Oh my god, I think it might be. That is, talk about freaking troll all lol This is supposed to be the rarest dogman in the game, or one of them, and I'm pretty sure I've seen it four times this run. That is actually ridiculous. Yeah, there's no way I fully upgrade everything because drone control is so expensive. So here... Here. Okay, and we already have a pre-igniter. I bought it six stores ago. Stop selling me extra ones. Yo, dog, I heard you like pre-igniters. So I got a pre-igniter. So you can pre-ignite your pre-igniter. So that while you're pre-ignited, you can pre-ignite your pre-igniter. Yo, dog. Do, 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 do. <laughs> I'm like, Yo, dog, do you have a pregnator? How would you like a halberd beam? I don't, I don't need more weapons. I have, I have five flax right now. I'm pretty sure I'm good on weapons. <laughs> Stop giving me pregnators. All right. Uh, hey, how about we use our defense drone that we've never used? Backup battery. Mind control the pilot. <laughs> One shot his repair drone. Do, 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 do. Not my engines. No, what'll I do? I guess I'll have to kill you before you can fire your Vulcan two times. Guess I'll just go ahead and do that. All right, 142 scrap. I can get. I can max everything except drone control. That will be my my thing here. We'll max everything except drone control. Next jump, there's a free pre-igniter floating in space. Anyone interested? Nah. Nah. <laughs> I'm good. I'm good on that. Oh, I think that was going for artillery. That would have been a good hack. All right, what do I hack? I think I hack missiles so I never take damage. There's no way I can have enough power for all the... all the things. Oh, you hacked my hacking. It's fine. Uh, I think I kill him before he gets his other cloak off. All right. Zero damage phase one. Man, after our long, long runs last Thursday, this is going to be a really quick win. This is like a record time here. And let our backup battery go away. Okay, there we go. This looks good. Yeah. <laughs> By good, do you mean ridiculously overpowered? Then yes. Then yes, it does. All right, I will do the same thing. There we go. Should not take any damage. Actually, I would love to get some crew kills here, though. 
Beautiful. Like that. How the hell did that guy not die? Damn. All right. Well, a fully upgraded almost everything. We're looking like this will be a flawless victory. Oh, three scraps short of getting level five drone power that I can't use. Not even level five drones. Okay, counter that. He boards me. You there, you there, you there, you there. All right, we have to, we, we have to get a flawless win here. We just got to. And that means I have to cloak this missile. And buy some time here. I don't know if this is gonna work. I think I think it's not gonna be in time. Damn. All right, four shields, fifty-five percent dodge. It's the max defense you could have. Hey, okay, all right. All right, we should we should have we should have the flawless victory now. Level four artillery, eh. Again, I would rather just put power in my flax. Scrapyard special victory, I got an achievement. <laughs> what does that mean? Well, that was a scrapyard special. Uh, probably the amount of scrap we got. GG cookie time, what a freaking OP ship that was. So that was the, from some guy, the Voids Edith. Ridiculously OP ship. I think we just got a scrap record from that run. 56.98. Wow, you're pretty close. Kenny, 59. 6,400 plus? No. <laughs> um, wow, actually... That is lower scrap than some of my other wins. Okay, I need to do something real quick before we finish this run, because I need to see what the ship looks like exploding. Um, but I also need to see what that achievement was. Scrapyard special. Okay, it doesn't show all the... Achievement. So is that like a Steam achievement? It's so weird that there's in-game achievements and I can't see some of the achievements that it tells me. Uh, okay, so we got to we have to get this ship to die real fast because we just need to see what the uh, death animation looks like. So let's get all of our defenses and weapons turned off and let's go let's go die real fast. All right, attack. You have a missile. I have 45 health. This is going to take a while. All right, everybody. Let's let's chill out while we slowly die to a single miss. Oh, wait. This guy can't kill me, can he? I have 45 health. He can't kill me with a missile. Okay, never mind. We'll just take damage as we get ready to leave. Uh, you also have a custom animation when you die on yours. Okay. The real sim is yours. The... Zultan C better because I won't be able to play if it's that one because I don't have the Zultan C unlocked yet. Okay. The hell. Really? We didn't dodge the ion. Let's let the missile hit. There we go. And let's go. We gotta fight somebody who doesn't have a missile. Missile is now the weakest thing we could fight because they just run out. Don't care. Come on. Somebody kill me. It's the Stealth B Zoltan mod. 
Stealth B Zoltan mod. What? Okay, you have a heavy laser. This will work. I don't have Stealth B unlocked yet either. Um, so I think I so I think I already did load yours though. Okay. Okay. Cool. So we will play that one if it's not looking too buggy or anything. Open doors. Oh. Damn it, that would have been the way to go, and now I can't because they just destroyed my tours. I could have just vented my... No, venting, that won't work. Because that won't... That won't let us see the ship exploding. That will just get my crew killed. I actually want the ship to explode because I want to see everything fly off. We want to see what the gib animation looks like. I could spread the fires and take more damage. Yeah, okay, sure. See if I can do that. All right, race against the clock. Can I repair the doors and open them so the fire spread faster than he kills me? Angie boarding party online. I mean, repair party online. Beautiful. Let's repair our sensor so we can see us, see ourselves as we die. Uh, actually, I need to. Uh, I need my crew to not suffocate before they kill me. So that is kind of an issue. All right, one more hit. Let's see it. Let's see it. Show me your animation, Void Edith. Woo! <laughs> Look at every piece. Every piece. All right, that's pretty cool. <laughs> Would be funnier is if the speeds were faster than they really flew off. But all right, so that was the Void Edith for some guy. Not bad. Not bad. All right, so let's. Uh, I'm, I am going to take a break before the next ship, but let me pull up the next one. The looter. Um, are you sure? Was it the looter? It's the looter. Okay. That one looks kind of broken, though. It's got exclamation points everywhere. Uh. So you're missing some stuff. You you forgot to put. You forgot to put um, the manning stations. I think it worked on your PC. Well, okay. Um, maybe I have the old one. You said that I think there are multiple versions. Maybe send me the new one, real quick. I'm gonna send send it to Trish. If you can resend me it, um, maybe maybe I can re-download it. But real quick, I'm gonna send Trish. She's rushing. Thank you all so much for watching. Is anybody in the stream? Please hit the follow. Hope you're enjoying the FTL. Uh, if you can, if you can send me the fixed version, hopefully we can uh, get that downloaded. I'll be right back, my friends. Y'all rock. See you in a bit. <laughs> 